Last week on The Realm. Hold up, anticipating. I was born by the river. Born beneath. Every time we come around, thinking it's all right. Everybody line it up, who's trying to win? Just a little bit of fame, that's what you want. Got a mic in the stage for days, turn it on. Got your attitude check, fit check, B O I C E check. Oh shit, I can feel it in my bones. The music taking over, what the hell is going on? Don't stop, I like the way you feel. The shit kinda crazy, like I trapped in the realm. Don't stop, I like the way you feel. The shit kinda crazy, like I trapped in the realm. Don't stop, I like the way you feel. The shit kinda crazy, like I trapped in the realm. Obviously, we have we have gave you our pros and cons of everything. So I'm gonna just get straight to the point. Um, the person, it's a lot of you guys up here. Um, I think the person that we chose to not go home is Faith, Miss Faith Evans herself. That's okay. Um, another person that was just, I think glaringly obvious to everyone who's not going home is my man, Mr. Sam Cook. Another person who is still in this competition and not going home tonight is Usher. Can we get our last two to step forward, please? Y'all gonna leave me. I don't, I don't mind being the bad guy, I guess. Oh, God. <sighs> Y'all write it down. <laughs> Listen, I'm a Sagittarius. I'm just gonna cut the head off the snake. You both were great, but it was a unanimous decision to send Miss Erica Badu. I'm sorry, but this would be your last stop of this competition. Thank you. All right, y'all can exit. Erica, stay up here. What do you think you want to say? Thank you. And I'm next time I'm going to wear a better head wrap. Yo, now they got rid of Erica. Oh my God. Oh my God. I think it was because that turban. That turban did fall off. But then, not only that, y'all, she did a little. <coughs> that little thing. I don't think she should have did that. It reminded me of uh, R. Kelly's wife, who, who no, she was doing all that. And I was like, that was a little bit too much, but she wasn't bad though. Did y'all, did y'all vote right? Because now all we got is Kyra, my son, Josh, and Morgan. That's a good little bunch. I'm ready to see what's gonna happen. Okay, so y'all know every episode we start off with an icebreaker because it's a new day. Your emotions are going. You might be a little nervous. So we got to get that up out of you because I want them on that stage and I need them giving me their all. So today's icebreaker is next line. Now, how this works is the DJ will play any random part of a song, but only five seconds of it. And when he cuts it off, the contestant has to immediately jump in and sing the next line. Okay, y'all, let's go on back in the room and see what they're going to do. Now we are down to four contestants, you guys. <laughs> Morgan, you are first. All righty. Turn around and you're standing here. You get here. Nobody's supposed to be here. I tried that love thing for the last time. My heart says no, no. Nobody's supposed to be here. But you came along and changed my mind. Right. I don't I'll give get it. it. Morgan. I don't get it. Right. right. I don't even. Bro, I'm so... Uh. <laughs> All right, okay. So she came out singing. She said, oh, y'all got to top that. I'm jealous. Okay, next, Kyra. No 
never wanted you to stay too long just wanted you to show me up won't you say my name say my name you say you want me playing games acting kind of shady can't even call me baby yeah uh. won't you say my name say my name Kyra. Okay. Kyra. All right. <laughs> right. Kyra. 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 Okay, Josh, you got to follow behind this. The women coming in hot today. All of them. Oh, he's aware. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Okay. These young boys didn't know what to do. That's what you get every day when you fucking with me. That was not the next line. You know what it was, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> you I ain't know the next line. You know what? Oh, we know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Come on, hot son. <laughs> you give me half a chance, I'll prove this to you. I will be patient, kind, faithful, and true to the one who loves music, to the one who loves art, respects the spirit world, and thinks with his heart. I can't wait. Uh, I can't wait. I cannot wait till I lose weight. I'm going to dress exactly <laughs> like that. I want to give a special thank you to Sister Rita's for sponsoring this video, home of the booming Cali style street tacos. If you need them to pull up and bend for you, make a great meal, whatever the case may be, make sure you hit them up at 2670 East College Avenue, Decatur, Georgia, or you can follow them on their Instagram, which is Sister Rita's. Thank you so much for sponsoring The Ram. Okay, I think that went well. Everybody seems to be relaxed. I think the jitters are out. So let's go on again to this first game. Now with the games, you will be judged. Now to refresh your memory, the judges will be judging on your personality, your appearance, your overall performance, your creativity, and then your effort slash originality. All right, the first game is called Do You. Now the reason I picked this is because I want us to get to know the artist, their song, what they represent, their sound, something that they're comfortable in. So I allowed them to pick one of their favorite songs that they created, they wrote, they produced, whatever the case may be, and they need to get on the stage. I'm giving them three minutes to get up there and to do them, to leave it on the stage, to impress us, and to let us know who they are as an artist. So go up there and do you. Let's go to the round trip. Look, let's go to the round. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Are they supposed to be originals? Yeah, that, that ain't original. Yeah, that's not original. You stealing. She already come in the competition stealing, girl. Like we wasn't going to know that song. After all this time, I never thought that we would ever be. The moment that our eyes met, can't deny that there's still chemistry. It's been 10 years since you come around, but you still came on in and you knocked me down. Maybe it's the time for us to be each other's fantasy. It's been so long, where did we go wrong? I have a feeling that Love could be strong, boy. Don't be afraid. Promise that I'll love you the right way. We could try again. If I 
finally have a happy ever ending Be the peaches to your herb I could Reunited and it feels so good Love is up tonight I don't want to waste any more time Now that you're here Never want to let you go And I want you to know I'll be all that you need Be the one that you can trust The only one that you can run to Your hiding place No rush, we can take this at a slow pace Thank you guys Thank you so much, Morgan Led. How y'all feeling? Y'all feeling you liking it, judges? All right. Hassan Green, come on up here. Come on up here. And it's time for you to do you. All right, let's do it. We're going to do it easy. How was everything over the week, uh, Hassan? How, how's everything been going? You had a good week? I had an amazing week. All right, that's what I like to hear, and man. A three day weekend. Sound like it was easy. Easy. <laughs> hey. It's easy. It's easy. It's from the first time I saw you. I knew you were the one for me From the very first time I saw you I knew I wanted you to meet my family It was your smile, it was your style I saw you from within And every time I see your face I fall in love again See, I know that life gets hard but loving you is the easy part You make loving you easy hey. You make loving you easy And verse 2 for you, baby, right here it ain't no way, ain't no way I could love someone else. No, I would rather send be by myself. Hey, baby, ha, I, I know, I know, I know that life gets hard, baby. But loving you, that's the easy part. Thank you. Hey, man. Y'all make some noise for Hassan Green. All right, Hassan. He made that look easy. <laughs> All right, Hassan. All right, next, coming up to the stage, we have Kyra. Come on, baby. How y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? We having fun? Okay. This right here is called Streets. It's one of my favorite songs. If you feeling good, I just need a little, I need a little head, you know what I'm saying? A little neck action. I see, you know you want to move, Miss <laughs> Okay. Can I? Yeah. Can I be a baby for the night? I see you riding solo when you ride. You seem to be on my type of time. Ain't seen you in a minute, you like to hide. But I see you on your shit, you back outside. Ain't trying to be in your mix, I'm trying to slide. And I see you on my body, cause you lie, yeah. We grown, baby, you can lose the pride. We can creep, creep, pull up in your Jeep. Pull up in the streets, you got me going crazy. The way we be, it's me. Three and we just linking, who you so crazy? Let me know if it's the thing you wanna try. We can go away and we can spend the night. Ain't no need to be so jaded for the night. If you let me be your baby for the night. 
Get out your feels, just let it all go. Get out your feels, just let it all flow with me. Get out your feels, just take it slow. Oh, 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 oh. If you can feel me, let me know, baby. And I know you usually play it straight. Keep your distance, trying to stay away. But you know you made the same mistake. The last time I saw your pretty face. But something's telling me you need me. So you came out here to see me. Thank you. Next, coming to the stage, we have Josh Waters. Y'all make some noise for Josh. I ain't gonna lie, my son went from Ursha to Lil' JJ. Right. <laughs> Here we go. Little red Corvette, but it ain't that fast. The ego ain't your friend for real. That shit way too sensitive now. She don't want nobody. I don't need nobody else, cause I already got her. Ain't nobody stopping her, get away, yeah. We think we found a way out Ooh, crash, crash, don't wanna die, die Cover my eyes now, we're going down Ooh, I apologize, said it'd be alright That turned into a lie, we're going down Down, 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 down At the mess we made, we took it too far. Yeah. Knew you overstepped when you jumped in my car. And now that you're all stalled out, and we're completely stuck on the median, seemed like we had no choice. But we did, we did, yeah. It's no. over, it's over. Ooh, crazy. All right, y'all, so, oh, come on up here. Come, come stand with me, stand with me, stand with me. So y'all wrote your own songs, yes, everybody? So is there anything y'all want to tell them? I have to be fair by saying, for one, music is subjective. So I can sit here and give you my opinion um, all day. But if I had to... If I had to say anything about you all's music, honestly, there were some I there were some songs I liked more than others. Um, but I'll wait to deliberate, you know, to give you a fair deliberation when the time comes. That's fair. For me, and I know how hard this could be because, like, I'm a songwriter too. The only top line that I can sit here and remember is the easy. And that's the only thing, and I know, I know it's hard when writing a song, like to make a memorable top line, and I don't know about you guys, but that's the only top line I can remember. And it's not because you sang it, it's just I, I could remember that top line. So, but I, I thought everyone's songs were great, and you guys all, like I said, your voices are great, but that's important, as you all know as songwriters, in writing your songs to just come with that top line that people are gonna remember. You, could somebody bring me that stool? That stool up there, bring that stool. Ooh, I need uh, a mic stand. Put it up there in the center stage. Uh, okay. Which one? Miss Morgan. First one. Okay. Give her a mic. Put it on the mic stand. Okay. Sit there. All right, DJ, play her song. Play her song again. Well, since we're waiting for a minute, I just want to give y'all backstory on my song. We don't want no backstory. We want you to sing. He's this your out. song. Okay. You're selling to us. Oh, 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 oh. After all this time, I never thought that we would ever be. Oh. oh, oh. 
moment that eyes met, can't deny that there's still chemistry. Uh, it's been ten years since you came around, but you still come on in and okay, you're you can stop. Down. You can stop it. Thank you. The reason I did that is because this y'all original songs, and everybody except Aware stayed in the same spot. When you sung your song, all you did was rock back and forth. This is the stuff I'm talking about when I say you need to tweak your stuff. This is the stuff that I'm going to be taking off when I go to judge you. If you're not going to do anything but rock back and forth, why not sit down and sing that song because it's a slow song? Sing with you. You should have sat down and sang your song. You utilized the, st the stage, you know, left and right, but you didn't go over here. You utilized the whole stage. With you, I wrote down that you giving me Anthony Hamilton vibes. And you're also giving me Kim, K-E-M. So this is the competition where we want to see you. And you are giving us, well, giving me, I don't know about them, but you're giving me somebody that's already out there. So I need for you to tell us who you are and show us who you are. But if you all want to be singers, utilize the whole stage. And if you need props, get the props. He's just giving you the assignment. You put it together where you want to put it together. Uh, matter of fact, I, I guess I'll piggyback off that. I feel like some of the songs that you guys chose, if it's not, it probably sounds better on track. And I don't know if some of you, like Miss Coco, you said, uh, Coco, why am I still calling you Coco? Miss Lay, you, um, I felt you were very nervous. And to, pick, to piggyback off of what Sophia said, yes. I felt like with that kind of song, when you choose the song, it has to match the energy that you're performing on stage. You rocking back and forth with a song like that, it's a nice song. Again, it's a subjective to, to the listener. But if you're going to sell a song, you have to sell that song. And it looks like to me you were just, you were nervous and you were just kind of like on some like this is a tryout type thing. So when I, immediately when the stool got up there, right. Because that's the kind of song that, that, that you draw people in. It's more intimate. So just sitting there back rocking is like, ah. Uh, and I'm sorry, uh, Kyra, Kyra, the same with your song. It's a smooth bop. So I don't think it really showed your vocals because it was more like on some smooth rapping here, a little singing here. Come talk to me. Come talk to the judges. Like, sell that. Josh, the same with your song. If you guys are going to choose these songs, you have to actually practice in the mirror. Practice in your living room. Like, you keep singing about women, but you have not yet address the love of your life. You know what I'm saying? And you have to be able to imagine that and be creative because that's what you're here for. Again, this is a competition. Asan, me personally, loved it. You know, I love the style you chose. I love, you already said in the beginning, like, this is your vibe. This is what you do. I thought the song was very original, very, you know, catchy. And just like Justina says, it was very easy to remember and it's just, it's on the brain, it's smooth, it's, it's, it's calm. I don't think with that kind of style, it's a big performance that you gotta be all over the place because it's soulful. It's talking about things that I ain't even looking at you going all over the stage because I'm too busy over here in my own mind like, ooh, that's it. I miss what you did because I'm in here now. So that's a plus for me. I am so speechless. They're all amazing and I don't know who is going home. I don't even have an idea. Who can be going home? This is this is crazy. But I love it. Like I love it. So since I am confused, I need y'all to go over to the Instagram. It is right here. It is the real underscore USIC, which means the real music. And on the Instagram story, I will have a spot for you to give me your opinion and your thoughts on the contestants, okay? Take some of the pressure off of us. And I also want to connect with you guys, okay? All right. Ah, oh, so here comes the hard part. It's so delicious. And this is so crazy because they're all so good. But somebody gotta go. <laughs> okay? All right, you guys. So the elimination game is nobody leaves here without singing the blues. Now, how this works is I ask each contestant what was their favorite pop song or song in general, right? And they told me, and y'all listen to me, the twist I added was they don't know when they get on that stage, that song they gave me, they're going to be changing it into a blues song. 
And the reason I did that is because in this industry or in life itself, you're going to get thrown curveballs. And I want to see how well you can handle that. An artist needs to be able to think quick on their feet. So let's get ready and go to the rim and hear some blues. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. It's just you and me, baby. And it's very superstitious. Uh, yeah. You know that the writing is on the wall. Very superstitious. Uh, uh, Set the ladders about to fall. But guess what, baby? 13 months old, baby. You know that she broke the looking glass. Seven years of bad love. You know the good things in your past. But I got good news for you tonight, baby. If you believe in things that you don't understand, then you suffer, 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 suffer. suffer. Superstition ain't the way. Damn, Hassan, you are so fucking nice. What the hell? Hassan, it was all right. All right. right. Don't y'all come up here playing now. Hassan done put it on his floor. He did him, and now he brought me the blues. It was all All right. right. You know the... Oh, no. trying to make it. I'm a million dollar baby. Said we gon' do it, do it. You wanna do it, do it. We gon' get to it, baby. I'ma make you do it, do it. I ain't never rapper said no, no. I could be good to ya. Do something you won't forget, baby. Straight about the hood for ya. Million dollar baby, that's how we gon' do. Make you go crazy. Yeah. I'm a million dollar baby, baby, baby. I'ma put it on your good, good, good. Thank you. Let's go, Kyra. Right, Kyra, she came up in here and turned that into the blues. I ain't even recognize the original. Right, <laughs> it turned to a whole new song. She okay, was all next. Right. What she say? was all right. <laughs> Do you like anybody? I love Jesus. <laughs> well, he ain't down here singing. <laughs> Why don't you sit out the palm of your hands? Why don't we leave it at that? Ringing the bell, somebody's coming to hell. Why are you sitting at home on the floor? Oh, in this world, 
It's just a Some noise for Josh. <laughs> yeah. Just a small town girl living in a lonely world. Just a small town boy, born and raised in South Detroit, a singer in a smoking room, the smell of wine and cheap perfume. Oh, Could y'all give me a blues beat? Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Come on. Give us a oh, how y'all doing tonight? <laughs> we get ready to do this thing for y'all. Oh, hot the dog dead, sad on the wall. Hey, hot the dog dead. He had, had a, a great, great fall. All the king horses and all the king men, they couldn't put Humpty back together. So oh, 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 he sat oh, on that wall. Yeah. All right, thank you. Yeah. Humpty <laughs> Dump sat on See, the wall. Just one last thing from me. He, he is giving you all assignments. That was to turn a pop song into a blues song. You all are artists. Neither one of y'all went and consulted with the band. Y'all just worked with what they gave you. You're the artist. Go and tell the band what you want. So I'm gonna see you guys next week. Go over to the Instagram, pick who you feel should have went home after the, after the day so we can see your votes on our Instagram page to see who will be going home next week. Coming up on The Realm. And y'all know I'm the hardest judge up here, yes. but I don't know which one of y'all going home tonight. You sang last week, that was talent. Today, that was purpose. You right where you needed to be. Somebody's gotta go. Hey! Somebody's gotta go. Uh -huh. Who it is? Who it is? I don't know. Who it is? Who it is? Would you rather fight 500 ostriches or one T Rex? I'm gonna do the ostriches. I think, I'm, I think I'm, uh, I think I'm, uh, what's his name? <laughs> From her shot with me. I think I'm exactly. back. So I'm gonna be doing all type of spin, baking them out. I'm gonna say one T Rex because he's big and I can probably outsmart him. But 500 
Get it? Five hundred to go. Anything at one time. It's just too much. I think I'm gonna go for the T-Rex because five hundred. I think I can get away from maybe one, two ostriches, but five hundred. That's like a that's like an ant bed of ostriches. I can't escape that one, but that T-Rex, I'm only five ten. That's a big dinosaur. So I'm much smaller to him. I could like wear green and stand up like a tree. He'll think I'm like, I could get around him, but 500 ostriches, I just don't see it happening. Well, I'm little, so. <laughs> <laughs> the 500 ostriches ain't gonna work for me. It definitely is. It's not gonna work for me. And I run slow. So, it's not, They're bad. I feel like I can run underneath the ranks, you know, without them seeing me behind a tree. Mm -hmm. But them ostriches gonna find me. 